Hello everyone, Nadlabs here. Today I'm just going to be showcasing that it's possible to do mathematics in Godot, and I'm just using version 3.2. It says down there in the corner. Can I highlight it? No. But anyway, I'm just going to be showcasing how I was able to make this uh, solution or this uh, solution finder to the British Flag Theorem. The British Flag Theorem essentially states that if you draw a line from the corner of a rectangle or square to a certain point, then a squared plus c squared is going to be equal to b squared plus d squared, or d squared plus b squared. But whatever, you get the idea, right? So I found the proof, it was pretty simple. All you had to do was use Pythagorean theorem and show that you're actually going to be adding up similar bases and sides. But when I proved it for my math homework, I was like, oh yay, that's amazing. But I want to see it in action. And I just went ahead in Godot and made it. If you are interested in knowing how to make something like this, I'll be releasing a tutorial in a couple of days. I'm just refactoring the code right now, right? It's pretty messy in my opinion, but the version I have right now on GitHub, which is going to be this, and I'll update the code on GitHub. But you can see that no matter where I put it, I always get the same numbers. It's kind of hard for me to point with the mouse, but you can see that when I'm over here, it's, both of them say 727524, and the decimals are a little bit off and that's probably because Godot uh, rounds off to six decimal places but if we went to like an infinite number of decimal places I'm pretty sure it would still work but that's just the limitation of Godot and probably computers themselves so yeah that's all this video is going to be about just to showcase that it's possible to do really interesting mathematics in Godot